You're just in time for the next discussion of the day. It's all about matters concerning your career. And uh, in this particular discussion that we are about to have, we want to give it a different twist this morning because it is very important that even as we talk about career, we, and of course later on we shall be dealing with how you can be able to build your career uh, you know, before you go to that interview. But before we do that, how can you establish something that you want to do in future when you're still at a young age? Is it possible for a young person to know the kind of profession they would like to be in? when they grow up is it possible today let's talk about building young talent and to help us in this discussion i want to give you a very glimpse this is a young lady very young so young that she's in primary and has already has a youtube channel ladies and gentlemen next to me i'm introducing natasha bracker she is a content creator come sir natasha Okay. How are, you, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. You're feeling good? Yeah. Najua leo umeamka mapema unasikia roho inaenda. Yeah. Welcome to the station. Thank okay. you. Okay. And of course uh, to my far uh, right I am with uh, Mwalimu Wilfred Nyongesa. He, he is the deputy principal from Lakewood Emerald School. Karibu sana Mr. Nyongesa. Asante. How are you feeling today? I'm good. Yeah. I thank God that I'm I've got this chance uh, to be on why, and Thank the question you. the question is why. Yes. yes so, <laughs> <laughs> the question is why, why. why? Yeah, that's why. <laughs> Thank you so much for, for for coming, my brother. And of course, I will invite you all uh, uh, from wherever you're watching us from. Be part of this discussion. If at all you have comments and questions, uh, be, feel free to do so. If at all you have uh, you know um, any opinion or thoughts in regards to these matters that we shall be discussing, the hashtag as always is why in the morning. Tag me at Ram Maguko. The official station handle is at why. 254 channel. Remember, we are coming to you live from the broadcasting house here in Nairobi, Kenya. We are also streaming live through our website, and that's at www.kbc.co.ke forward slash Y254. How can you build young talent? And of course, uh, let me start with uh, you, uh, uh, Natasha. Uh, first of all, tell me something about yourself. Uko Shulegani, how old are you? And uh, this YouTube channel in Yanafanya. Okay, as you all know now, my name is Natasha Braka mm -hmm. and I'm in Lakewood Emerald School. I'm 10 years old and wow. I'm in class 4 primary. Class 4? When? Grade 4? Yes. Grade 4, yeah? Yes, hey. it is now grade 4. It's, it's now grade 4. Yes. But you're, you're in class 4. Yes, the, the previous 844. 4. Yes. When you were in class 4, what are you doing? Some of us are looking at us and I'm trying to walk up. Look on. What is that? Bricky John, I call him. This lady is having a YouTube channel. My goodness, generations are changing. Huh? Mr. Nyongi said, "What do you think when you see talent like this? The first time you you you, you met Natasha Braka? Yes. Uh, the first time when we met with Natasha Braka." She was transferring from our sister school, mm. that is uh, from Comarok. Now she was coming, switching to boarding section. Mm -hmm. And again, we had an interaction with the mother. Mm. It was uh, a good interaction. And the mother revealed to us that she had already an existing uh, YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. And we said, wow, that's an mm -hmm. opportunity for us. Because back at where we are seated in Lakewood Emerald, we have already an established media. Uh, that we run a number of things. We have uh, a social media on Facebook. We have a YouTube of our own and uh, a TV. And said, we are going to tap this talent wow, and wow, nurture wow. it to where it's supposed to be to benefit the society at the same mm. time, benefit the content creator. And, and, and I love what you're doing because even at Y254, we promote young talent. Yes. Y254, the number one Kenyan youth station. And yes. of course, even as you talk about youth station. Yes. You deal with youths mm -hmm. in that place. Yes. Tell us how can people follow you in that particular platform that you are in and something a bit more about Emerald School. Uh, as I said, uh, we have a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. That one you get us on Emerald TV. Mm -hmm. Though it's not a, an established TV that you get it, but on YouTube we are there. 
on uh, Facebook, we are there as Lakewood Group of Schools. Mm -hmm. Therefore, if you need to interact with us, you can easily interact with us mm -hmm. on those platforms. Mm -hmm. We have our demonstrators that are there. Mm -hmm. And uh, again, our doors are open, wide open. Anytime you feel like you want to get to our place, you get there. As I said, we also have schools in different counties. Mm -hmm. That is uh, 047, that is Nairobi, where we are. Mm -hmm. That is Nokoma, Rock area. And uh, 016, that is Machakos, Utawala area. And then 034, that is in Kajado, Kitengela. So whenever oh, you wow. want to interact with us, our school runs all through, as so, long as it's a, a weekday. So you have, you have a school in Komarok, yes. Machakos, mm -hmm. Utawala. Uh, we say Komarok, Machakos, that is Utawala, mm -hmm. and Kitengela in Kajado. Oh, Kajado. Kitengela. Yes. Ah, all right. Yes. All right. So, so, Thank you so much for mm. what, what you're doing. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 Natasha, yeah? how, how does it feel um, now that you're seeing yourself already having a YouTube channel? It feels good. Yeah. yeah. Feels good. Do you feel like um, uh, there is uh, that person that you're trying to be like? or Do, do you have this oh, 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 image? image? Yeah, this image that you're looking up to. Those people that motivate you to say, you know what, I want to start a YouTube channel. Who are these people? Um, actually, I want to become a journalist. Ah. I, <laughs> I made the YouTube channel because I wanted to start my own career of journalism. Journalism? Yeah. My goodness. And you, and you have people who are looking up to um, in journalism? Yeah. Okay. Who? Um, I look up to Ram. Oh. Oh. Uh-huh. And Thank I look you. up to Victoria Rubadiri. Victoria Rubadiri. Yes. Wow. <laughs> okay, I'm humbled. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So these are the people that you look up to in yeah. journalism. Yes. And, and, and you want to be like them. Yes. Um, what are just, just some of those things that uh, when you see inspire you and make you feel like you know nataka kufanya hii kitu na kuinspire na sema you know what i want to do this and this and this that's some of those qualities yeah do you have them yeah again like what's trending okay okay i love what's trending you love what's trending yes you love talking about um things that like gossip yes okay <laughs> do, do you know what's trending currently says Right now, uh. yeah, actually Queen Elizabeth died and today is her burial. Wow. My goodness. Na kuna slay Queen Mingina Jui. So Queen Elizabeth died and today is her burial. The president, uh, Ruto, went to, to visit, went to Nini, at, attend that occasion. Yes. Uh, pretend you are uh, a, a TV presenter. And uh, you want to talk about the latest trend, something that is trending. Peter, now this is you, Natasha Braka, live. I'll be like, mm -hmm. today we are going to be on what's trending. <laughs> if it's it. sports, uh -huh. I'll start with what's trending. If it's music, if it's art, mm -hmm. yeah. You start with what's trending, and you'll get to know what to touch on. Yes. I saw on your, on your video, on YouTube, I saw you even interviewing other, your fellow schoolmates or kids. Yes. How did you come up with that idea? What, what were you doing there? We were actually competing boarding versus day school. Okay. Yeah. So talking about uh, which school is best? Which type, as in mm. going back home and seeing your parents, mm. or getting enough time to learn? Or getting enough time to learn. Oh, so so if if you're in boarding, mm. do you feel like it's a good thing to be in boarding school, or is it a good thing to be in day school? Me, for me, I think it's a good thing to be in boarding school. Okay. Yeah, because you get enough time to learn. Mm -hmm. Yes. You love boarding. Yes. Would you like your mom to take you to boarding school? Oh, that is already... Emerald School is a boarding school. It's a boarding. Yes. Yeah. So that's why you love boarding school. Yes. yes. Okay. 
Okay. So when you're boarding and you're interview and, and you're talking to your, your your fellow kids and you are interviewing them, um, do you also get to learn things from the other side? Yes. Uh, okay. Mr. Nyongesa, when you see young talent like like this, I believe that uh, it 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 gives you some some drive, some yeah. something to look up to, something to wake up in the morning and say, you know what, I want to do this. Now, maybe Raf, uh, Rama, I take you back because when you are going to school earlier, our days, uh. you couldn't have this opportunity, you couldn't get this chance to create a YouTube, you couldn't have chance to get a teacher who nurture you are. You, maybe your career. Imagine. In fact, you are juggling things up here and there just to fix, to know what would I like to be in the yeah. near future. Some people are walking to school barefoot. Barefoot. And in fact, you could come back at home and miss even lunch because you didn't have lunch by that time. But we thank God because time has changed. And then mm -hmm. we have a type of uh, braca with us in, in our school. We really appreciate And again, we also want to acknowledge the CBC. Now we are talking about her being in grade four. Mm. And we are not just saying that CBC uh, is just something that is there maybe. No, it's, here, it's there to help us to nurture talents like uh, uh, that of Natasha. Mm -hmm. Now that Natasha is here talking mm. of becoming a, a journalist mm. uh, and the, in the near future she wants to emulate and do be like Rav, Ram and again Victoria Rubadiri, how can we nurture this thing and come up clearly? CBC is there to aid us. CBC is there to make us understand mm -hmm. and tap the talents from these kids as early as 10 years. Mm -hmm. Start mm -hmm. rolling it. Keep it rolling. Till so now, Rubadiri comes mm -hmm. out of her. You, you, you believe CBC is a good move for the country? Of course it is. Because... Uh, Rafa, I don't want to ask you this question, but mm. I want to assume mm. that you came to realize yourself as a journalist, maybe later, after Form 4. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Yes. And after from, Form 4? Uh, uh, from my end, I was like, I want to be a journalist. Mm. At the same time, I want to be a teacher. At the same time, I said I want to be a lawyer. So at the end of the day, I... I I found myself in between trying to fix, but good mm. from our end, we are able to tap and nurture the talents and give them the pathway that they deserve. When I was growing up, yes. um, my, 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 my parents always asked me this question. Mm -hmm. What do you want to be when you grow up? Mm -hmm. At first I said a doctor. Uh -huh. Natasha, yeah. I wanted to be a doctor. <laughs> uh -huh. A doctor? Yes. And then I said I want to be an architect. Mm -hmm. And then I got confused. Nikasema ah, acha acha nikai tu kwanza. And then later on I said um, I want to be kuna nini ni engineering ama nini ni kwa nataka tena. I came up with so many things and I realized I wanted to be a journalist after my form 4. True. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you were growing up, okay, what you said. <laughs> <laughs> Mom the first time I told her I want to be a singer. Singer? Yes. Uh, and uh, do you love singing? Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. So it, it, it changed again? Yes. Again, to... when she asked me, mm. I said I want to be a dancer. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. So when did you... So this journalist is going to die? Yeah. After then, I grew older. Uh. Yeah. Okay. So then, when she asked me, I said, now I'm not changing. I uh. want to become a journalist. So you won't change it? I will not change it. But kids change their mind. Ama? Yes, they do. But again, at the same time, uh. it all depends on the, the, the environment that is offered. Uh -huh. You see, when you leave this kid in an open uh, Va uh, like a vacuum like now. A vacuum. Yes, yeah. Yeah. nobody is there to nurture these kids. Nobody is there to guide them and to orient them. And mind. orient them their mind. Mm -hmm. Like now, already she's on our TV as we are speaking right now. She is interacting with what she wants to become mm -hmm. in the future. Mm -hmm. So this one will help this kid to grow, knowing what she wants to be. But now, look at her scenario. You are growing back in the village. 
Mm -hmm. You have never interacted with a TV. You have never interacted with a, a role model that will help you, the teachers, or maybe we don't mean where they are. Mm -hmm. But again, you know, the, 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 the environment is so important. It's a tool to lead you where you want to go. Um, Molimu, let me look at uh, uh, the angle of parenting. Yes. Um, kuna wazazi wingi ambao nasema kwamba, now, I know you want to be a musician, but mm -hmm. soma kwanza. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, I know you want to do music. Mm -hmm. uh, Natasha wali soma wantaka kwa dancer. Yeah. I want to, to sing, but soma, soma kwanza. kwanza. Mm. Uh, what do you think about that particular approach of parenting? Uh, we'll, we'll not say it is bad. Coming from a teacher's perspective. Perspective. Because you deal with parents. Yes, uh -huh. we deal with the parents. But again, we need to be alive to the fact that uh, the world is a learned world that we are living in today. And therefore, as much as you want to be a musician, you want to sing, mm. you must have a language. You what must have a language, language uh -huh. to communicate your uh -huh. message to the audience. Again, I will not really criticize the parent angle of you mm. because again, she or he is helping you to get this language, to get the media, because you're not singing in your vernacular. You know, be, you'll be only be limited to where your language uh, is. Mm. And then you'll be having a problem with language barrier to the rest of the audience. And so when you have the language, if you go through school, through the school, you get this language, you acquire the skills, you'll be very easy for you even to go internationally. Mm -hmm. You get it? Mm -hmm. And therefore, I will not say that it's bad. At the same time, a parent should also allow the child on the other end to explore mm -hmm. the area that this child wants to mm -hmm. be when he or she becomes a, a, a grown-up. All right. Yes. Uh, Natasha, um, yeah. what do you think about mom? Mom, mom has supported you. Uh, at least we are seeing that she's, sub, she's doing something. Yes. What do you think about how parents are coming from uh, you know, your perspective, from your own eyes? You know, at first you want to be this, you want to be that. Says you want to be a journalist, and mom is supporting you. You see the power? Yes, because mm. they are helping us choose what's better for our life mm. and what's better for our future. Mm -hmm. Yes. And do you feel like even other kids your age can also be helped to realize the career they want to take? Yeah, of course. It's possible. Yes. What can you tell? Those who are watching you, Leo, when you are a journalist, come away. Um, improve and try your best. Don't be shy on camera and speak of what you can. Wow. She, she gives me goosebumps. <laughs> <laughs> I want us to, to, to wrap uh, th this uh, conversation up. And, uh, of course, uh, Mr. Nyongesa, I'll give you time to, uh, of course, have a final word. Yes. And also tell us what t uh, subjects you teach in your school. Mm -hmm. uh, as we bring this conversation to a close, also give us your parting shot. All right. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Raf, or our host, Mr. Raf, here. Uh, I call you Raf. Ram. It should be Ram. Eh? Yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> I have a colleague of mine called Ram. And, so, uh, and I also have people, uh, Alana uh, in school called Raf. As but as you are Ram, isn't it? Ram. Correct. They're really uh, amazing, man. <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. <laughs> now, uh, as I said, my name is uh, Mr. Nyongesa. I'm mm. a deputy principal in Lakewood Group of Schools. And I want to say this. Uh, from our end as a school and uh, our directorship, I want to say thank you. And uh, number one, uh, I also thank the parent to our guy here who has done marvelous things to enable us be where we are because without her maybe we wouldn't know Ram and at the same time say Ram kudos for giving us a chance to interact with you on this platform. Is We are a school located in three counties and that is in uh, Nairobi in Comark area. We are also in Machakos that is county number 16. Utawala area, and we are also in County 034, that is in Kajado, Kitengela. And therefore, you can reach uh, to us in our social media platforms, that is Facebook and YouTube, whenever and at any given time. We are there to nurture talents like what we are having today here, All that right. is Natasha Braca, and to build. If you have a kid in any sphere, in any area of uh, his life, if 
He is a footballer, she is a footballer. We are nurturing and bringing up a holistic citizen right. and God-fearing. Our motto is honoring God through excellence. And All that right. is what Thank we you. pursue. To As understand I'm a limo. Yes. Una funcha subject, uh, which subject do you teach at uh, Emera? Mimi ni mwalimu wa lugha ya Kiswahili. Kwa hivyo kama utaniruhusu tu nipindue lugha kidogo basi. Swadakta. Na ndela shaka. Waje tutapindua lugha. Unataka kupindua lugha kwa Kiswahili sasa. Nataka kusema hivi. Eh. Ah wahenga na wahenguzi wao kukosea waliposema kwamba chanda chema kuvikwa pete. Kwa hivyo hivi leo tunavulia kofia stationi moja kabambe stationi ya Y254. Kiswahili lenyewe. Hilo. Jibuni eh mbona uende kwingine kama si why 254 azare azare basi ah tuko na shabiki <laughs> <laughs> Natasha yeah. um nat nataka tumalize interview si ndio um natukimalizia nataka uambie um uh, you know speak to your fellow agents but now tell them something that can inspire them encourage someone when you home size someone watching you you know motivate them within a short time um i would like to say keep off and look up to your image wow. and don't give up never give up wow what's your, what's your youtube channel my and youtube channel mm -hmm. is natasha braka daily natasha braka daily so yes. guys go there subscribe to that channel support young talent build young talent are you a parent do you have young talent that you feel uh, you don't know how to handle it you don't know what to do about it keep engaging with us and of course we shall be able to you know uh, uh, communicate on our online platform thank you so much mr nyongesa you're welcome sir Asante sana karibu braka natasha yes keep it up thank i'm proud you. of you all thank right you. and i wish you the best okay and of course, that presents to the end of this uh, uh, discussion. We still have more coming up your way right here on Y in the morning. My name is Ram Aguko. It has been a pleasure being with you, but stick with us because in our next conversation, we want to talk about the next issue concerning your career. This is Y in the morning.